Hi guys, fan comms. Next on James. James 2 0 win today. Really good performance and a uh, great three points for the Reds. Once it against a decent Forest side. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I thought we played really well. Um, I thought Styles was exceptional. Ooh, really yeah. got his foot stuck in. Brilliant going forwards. Lots of passion. I thought the whole team were excellent. It was a really good performance. Yeah, it, it seems to be since Valley and Ishmael's came in, they just seem to have a new lease of life. This team now. Definitely. I think I think game management as well has been superb. Mm. Like, um, you've not seen so much playing the ball out from the back. We're sort of getting rid of the ball a lot more, which is good. Mm. I thought we started off a little bit sloppy, but we sort of, once the game got going, we sort of got into it a little bit more. Mm. Yeah, I, I agree. I thought that first five minutes, we had that that chance. I think, I can't remember who it was. It might have been Freezer or something. Not really a chance. And then got the corner. Then from there, we, we were a bit sloppy. Forrest were probably... A bit more on top than us, like, but we just seem to be able to be able to create chances a lot easier now. Whereas before, you know, you know, we we were very not negative, but just very slow and boring to watch. Whereas now we're a lot more entertaining. Yeah, definitely. I think I think we're we're willing to take it to teams like whoever we're playing against. He wants mm. to win. And that's what I've really liked. We've, we've sort of given it a real good go with whoever we're up against. Yeah. Do you think? Do you think um, even? Go on, go on, James. Finish what you were saying. I mean, Forrest and no mugs. I mean, they are coming into the game in good form, and mm. yeah, it's really pleasing performance. Mm. Yeah, on, on what you said there about going into games, what trying to win. Do, do you think it, it, there's obviously the risk factor involved, isn't there, with that st that system? But then again. Would you accept that as a fan going into a game wanted wanted to win every game rather than before before Valley and Ishmael we were sort of sitting off teams? Do you get where I'm, do you get where I'm coming from? Yeah, whereas, yeah, I get, yeah. whereas I'd, I'd, yeah, I'd rather say it's giving it a go. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, and that's what we seem to be doing. And we, we pick result. I mean, four wins out of five, I, we'd have took that easy. Oh, definitely. And you look at the table now, thirteenth in the league, um, and we're closer to the playoffs than what we are. If, relegation which is brilliant it's nice to see and a positive goal difference as well I know I know that's fantastic it's not, not often really... that happens in championship I know I was really pleased for Woodrow as well because he hit the bar twice I thought, I thought it weren't going to happen and then like when he scored I thought I was absolutely buzzing for him so. yeah uh, well, it's, for, it's, it's only his first goal from up and play and all that I it's, know. It's, oh, it's crazy yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pleased for him as well I mean there's there's a lot of standouts as well though. like you said Callum Styles, Woodrow Callum Britton, who I think has been fantastic. Oh, superb. Uh, I mean, Jordan Williams was playing well and um, he's done well to keep him out of the side. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's good competition for places as well. There's always that uh, to, to, to go on as well. But I can't speak hardly enough of the whole team, really, at the at moment in time. Uh, when do you think, how long do you think we can carry it on for? Because that that's a problem we've had it past, isn't it? The consistency side of things. How long do you think we can ca carry on for? I don't know. Hopefully, we can just keep it going, and I think I think it helped today with the five substitutions as well because you've yeah. got players coming in fresh, making an impact. Um, got yeah, lots of quality yeah, the yeah. as well, which is good. Yeah, the five substitution thing that they've brought in. I mean. Uh, yeah, it gives, gives, gives Valley and Ishmael opportunity to bring a few players in. And, and, and obviously, like we said in your last interview with Victor Adebayajo, I mean, he's come on again today and made an impact. I thought he was really good, actually, because he used his strength quite well. Because when he was mm. for the goal, it was brilliant because he used his muscle, passed it to Woodrow, and it was a really good bit of football from him. Mm. Who, who would you give man a match to today? I'd probably go with Callum Styles today because yeah. I thought he was everywhere, but... There's, yeah. so, there's so many so many others that could have got it, but I mm. think that strike he did on his foot was superb, and left back it was brilliant as well. It's like he's, he just this just seems to be unbelievable talent we've got. He do, does, he does, and uh, I mean I said to I think it might have been Dave last interview that is it <laughs> he's going to be one of the players in the next few years. Are we going to be lucky to still have him here? Yeah, I think so. I wouldn't be surprised to be playing in the Premier League in a few years, like because mm. I mean he's 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 only what twenty years old or twenty. 20 yeah, he's not. Yeah, he's not yeah. old. He's he's still very young. And I mean, he's got so many years he can grow. It's mm. it's just brilliant. It's, yeah, the well, future's uh, future's bright for him, mate. And yeah. hopefully, you know, it's looking brighter for, for Barnsley as a club. Do you know what I mean? I mean, can well, you, I know. Do, do, I know. What, just... what would you say is a realistic target now? Would you say 
top top half, mid table. I mean, it's, some fans of it. I think they're joking when they say, "Oh, playoffs, oh, we're going up all this and yeah. that." Where are you saying? Are you are you thinking more or less mid table is a realistic view? Um, I think really the best bet. I think we've just got to approach it each game at a time and just mm-hmm. go for it. Um, try and exploit teams' oppositions because that's where we've normally been successful in the past. So, mm. um, yeah, I'd be I'd be happy where we are now. But as long, long as we give it a good go in every game, so I do like a game by game approach. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's a decent way to look at it, mate. So, all right then, pal. Well, I'll let you crack on. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I'll speak to you soon. <laughs>